Hi, yeah. I was telling you last week I was going to show you the difference between Victorian and Edwardian furniture, and I have two lovely tables I'm going to demonstrate for you today. You will understand this one is about 150 years old, yeah, 1850s or thereabouts. And of course, there was no TV, no phones, so the main entertainment in the evening was card play. So these are both card tables. This is the Victorian one, the lovely, I was telling you about the lumpy furniture. This is a fabulous piece of mahogany. And you'll see the way, they just love big lumps of it. And the fabulous swathe, fabulous movement in the legs. Real solid piece all together. And then of course, so easy just to open out this table, which would have been a side table as well during the day. And just pull it out. Look at the gorgeous scalloped edge on this here still available yeah, and you're straight on the playing your cards on a great evening. Uh, that shows you and of course the weight of this lovely piece of mahogany, so mahogany on the top. So this one is about 1850 thereabouts. Uh, now along to this one we're getting back over to the Edwardian period again. This is a tiny bit earlier because the beginning of it and this actually shows you the Art Nouveau style that's come in just before the Edwardian period and through it right up to the Art Deco period in the 1920s. It's also mahogany, also quality as you can see now a lovely piece of lighter mahogany but it's got the inlay that we spoke about last week um, and we also mentioned about apartment living. This is a perfect piece for that again because you've got your writing table you can sit at with your drawer, uh, your little cupboard for odds and sods, and then you have got your card table as well. So again, that just twirls around here, opens up. And look at that, fine card table for the evening. Now, the other thing is, all you have to do is throw a cloth on it, and you've got a tea table. So everything you need in a small piece of furniture again. Fabulous. Which would you choose? Victorian or Edwardian? I like both, I'm afraid. Thanks very much.